Hello everybody and welcome to yet another video of a video game, The Lord of the Rings, The Battle for Middle-earth 2. Today I will show you how I usually defeat 7 brutal bots. In this instance I only picked Mordor armies, but in the future videos I will change this to also fight various different armies. So the first few minutes are essential because the bots can easily overwhelm you since there are so many of them. It's much easier to use a custom hero, but if you don't want to use one, it's good to start with Eomir, because one of his passive abilities are really good for gathering resources. When he reaches level 4, he activates outlaw leadership and he gains resources from killing enemies even if he's just nearby uh, it's not necessary that he actually kills them usually I first build a farm an archery range and then another farm I want the buildings to be as close as possible so I can effectively defend them with battle towers when Eomer spawns it's best to use his horse to capture the building that gives extra resources as fast as possible I usually then capture another one of those buildings and start building towers and spawning archers. I think it's best to use Italian archers if you're playing men or some other archers that have high range. That way you can intercept enemies before they come close to your towers and other buildings. Your success also depends on how many enemies attack you at once. If they just send one group it's easier to kill them but if they send multiple groups of units they can overwhelm you and end the game early. As soon as Eomer captures both buildings buildings it's good to send him back to the base and stay near turrets to get to level 4 as quickly as possible and that way you can start getting more resources with his passive ability. If you manage to survive a first few waves then it gets a little bit easier and you can start building even more towers and spawning more archers. However, when they start sending catapults it can get more difficult. The same is true for most siege units like trolls, muma kills and so on. It's important to withstand those attacks and prevent them from coming too close to the farms and the fortress itself. Because you have limited command points it's wise to use support powers to attack the enemy bases while still protecting your base from their attacks. So once you establish your defense you can focus on the offense while still protecting your base and it's only a matter of time until you win the game. I will put the link of this game in the description. If you have any other good methods how to win against 7 brutal bots let me know in the comments and I might try them out in the future. Thank you for watching, please like the video and subscribe. Peace!